Chess friends, my chess match has been started, I play different tournaments at different levels of chess computers, Leela Zero, Dragon Chess, Ethereal and my own clone Classical Stockfish, and today I will show you some of my recent games, and if you new to my YouTube channel, then you can like and subscribe to my YouTube channel, Alpha Zero started with E4, C6, Knight here, D5, it is called Karo can set up, you can play Pawn takes Pawn, or Knight here, but we have D3, because of our book move, Bishop here, E5. Bishop goes to G4. Okay, B4, if you think you can take it, then takes, takes, Knight takes, Rook takes, the Rook will reach the 7th rank, so, C takes Pawn, Pawn takes, Pawn to a6, Rook b1, Knight develops, both side castle short, Knight here, I am threatening to win the pawn, here Alpha played Bishop g5, putting the Bishop in a good square first, Queen up, Bishop back to e2, Alpha 0's strategy is to play g4, Knight backs, Bishop f6 you can't take it, because of pawn takes, the dark squares and the king position will be weak, Queen here, Queen g5, h6 will be a big threat, so, I pushed the h-pawn, bishop backs, g5, bishop back all the way, f6, queen ups, takes, takes, knight e7, rook up to b3, rook slides, a4, knight here, targeting the pawn with three pieces, rook e1, if you think, you can take the pawn, let me show it, knight takes pawn, knight takes, 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 knight takes, rook to e3, queen to g7 is the best move, Bishop takes pawn, pawn takes, rook takes, your center pawns will be gone by the rook and the queen. White will make a passed pawn on queen side, black's king structure will be bad, so, back to the position, we have queen c7, bishop backs, queen here, pawn move, takes, takes, rook up to c7, rook here, pawn moves, knight goes to d4, takes takes, here, queen e3, you might say, stockfish just slow down, I need to observe all the moves, ok, he is threatening to play queen g5, targeting this and this, so rook to c2, let me target this pawn first, rook to f1, queen c7, queen to c7 move plan is to play rook here, knight here and so on, pressuring on this weak pawn, so rook to c1, rook takes rook, rook takes, queen backs, queen to g5, targeting the pawn, and threatening to play bishop here, queen check, king here, queen h5 check, knight blocks, queen takes check with the supporting of the bishop, so rook up to f5, queen back to d2, threatening bishop d3, rook back to f8, bishop to d3, knight f5, bishop f4, if you think, knight takes pawn is a good move, no, it's not, because of bishop g5, you will lose your knight or queen. And the v7 pawn is very weak, it can be targeted by the queen and the rook, queen to e8, bishop takes f5, rook takes bishop, queen here, queen g6, g3, stabilizing the position, rook back to f7, queen to b6, rook here, a5, he want to make a passed pawn by playing rook check, rook b8 and take the pawn, another strategy is to play queen b5, targeting on the rook, rook e7 isn't possible because of the bishop. And if you play rook to f7, then rook c8 check, if king here, then queen d8, queen and rook battery on 8th rank gonna destroy your king territory. So, we have queen f7, rook check, king to h7, queen check, queen blocks, queen here, rook goes to a8, d3, rook here, rook here, bishop here, queen takes takes takes, it can't be taken because of the bishop, rook here, rook b5, pawn move, takes, here, rook here, a takes pawn, ok, you need to stop to pawn first, so king f1, bishop wants to go there to promote it, bishop here, king g6, bishop a7, pawn promotes, takes takes, and after some moves later, we have some bishop king party dance, the king need to go back to destroy it. And few moves later he takes the pawn, takes, takes, move the pawn blindly, fight for justice, queen check, and it is called checkmate. Alpha wins because he got the white pieces, next game I have for you is the rematch between Alpha and me, I started with d4, knight here, pawn move, 
knight goes to f3, bishop to f4, bishop here, e3, bishop check, knight blocks and castle, I want to make few more developing moves to start attacks to black, oh, it's queen to b3, bishop to d3, in this position best move is knight h5 to target this, but alpha played shocking move bishop to e4, can you explain this bishop move? Bishop should not take the bishop, because of knight takes, it will create pressure to this knight, because it pinned, so, bishop backs, you might think, the light squares become weak, no it's not the actual truth, because after bishop g6, I played a3, followed by bishop takes, takes and rook to e8, I get a chance to play h4, now I want to play g4, h5, we have h6, g5, d6, I move pawn pawn to g5, if you take it, then bishop takes, pinning the knight to the queen, move the h pawn, bishop, backs, h6, takes, takes, then rook takes h7 bishop, king takes, play bishop e3 check, to create a entry diagonal for the queen, then knight e4, creating problems on this knight with knight and bishop, so, he played e5, kicking out the bishop first, pawn takes, takes takes takes, knight to f3, rook back to e8, you should not take the knight, then queen takes, the king structure will be maintained, and white's king position will be in a bad situation, so we have queen takes queen, rook takes queen, takes, takes. Double pawns on f file which will be bad at end game, knight here, knight goes to d7, bishop here, rook to b8, you might think, what about knight fork on c6, let me show the variation, otherwise you will not understand my arrow lines, if knight here to target this and this, then knight e5, targeting the bishop, if you play knight takes d8, then knight takes bishop check, king here to touch the knight, bishop to h5, and now, if you try to save your knight, then knight d4, discover and double check to the king and one rook for two pieces, which will be bad for you, so, in this position, we have bishop, d5, now you are threatening bishop c6, so, alpha 0 played knight e5, f4, knight check. King here, white is threatening to play knight c6, and f5, targeting this and this, and you know, black's rook are totally useless, they have no open files to control any of free squares, so knight takes b2, knight c6, forking in these rooks, bishop check, king slides, king here, takes, rook takes, a4, a5, rook slides, bishop to g6, threatening knight check to win a rook, so king here, knight d3, rook here, knight here, a5, you should not take it, because of rook takes, targeting on the knight and the pawn. This split pawns and double pawn are not good for end game, so bishop to f5, black needs so many developing moves to control and get active in the game, we have rook up to a2, rook to e8, pawn takes pawn, takes, rook here, knight here, rook up to d2, b5, takes takes, and after some moves later, we have this position, where I am threatening to play e4, with the three supporters, then f5, so he takes the bishop, rook takes, bishop here, rook here, rook g1 check, king runs, takes, here, few moves later. The rook gets involved into the seventh rank, and after king f6, I doubled up my rook on g file, bishop here, king here, king and bishop dance again, oh, I sacrificed my pawn for nothing, king here, rook slides, rook check here, again a rook check, king goes to g7, I get a passed pawn on g file, black is trying to get the h pawn behind from it, rook h2, rook here, rook check, here, check, the pawn is about one square from promotion, rook goes to h7, ok, I am not able to slide my rook, and push the pawn, so. I need to involve my king to support the other rook on h3 square, to support the pawn, so rook here, and after some moves later, king reached into the g1 square, rook here, rook goes to h2 square, rook takes rook, king takes rook, check, king takes, rook here, game is not over yet, black still make a draw if white is a human, but I am stockfish, the king crossed the fourth rank, rook here, check, the king is super aggressive, reached the e7 square, bishop here, rook check, few moves later, the king gets the 8th rank, f6. Rook slides, king here, king touched the pawn, king here, 
Finally king takes the f pawn, now I am threatening rook takes bishop, and rook to h1 check, so, king to h5, rook takes, takes, here, it is his mate in 5 moves, ok, checkmate by the rook and the king. Let me show our third game, if you are still watching my video then you are truly amazing guy, because this game is very interesting and chess friends, if you haven't subscribed our channel, then you can like and subscribe to my youtube channel, ok alpha started with e4, sicilian defense, knight here, d6, and the opening move ends on e6, you can play knight here, knight c6 or d7, b5, bishop to b7, alpha played bishop e3, knight here, queen d2, he want to play long castle. Then push the king side pawns to starts attack on king side if black dare to castle short, so, knight to c6, knight takes knight, knight takes knight, long castle, I moved my b5 pawn, we have f4, bishop here, king slides. Short castle, he played g4, he is getting smart by watching my videos, bishop b7, g5, rook slides, rook to g1, he want to play f5, and queen to f2 square, f2 square is a good position to keeping the queen, we have queen to a5, queen slides to f2, he is threatening to play bishop b6, queen here, then a3, all these squares will be covered by somebody, you will lose the queen, so bishop d8, protecting this square, bishop goes to d3, alpha wants to play queen here to target this, after playing e5, bishop will support that square, knight goes to b4, a3, knight takes bishop, rook takes b4, takes takes, bishop to d4, threatening to play rook here, queen here, to take the pawn, rook slides to e8, rook to d1, queen here, e5, takes, bishop takes, alpha can play queen here, to target the bishop, rook can't go there, because of the bishop's line, if you play queen back to c6, then rook to d7, creating problems to the bishop and the 7th rank, so bishop e8, rook to h3, queen here, I am offering queen exchange, rook d3, rook to d8, b3, rook takes rook, in this position, alpha 0 played brilliant move rook takes h7, well done alpha 0, the king, can't take the rook, because the queen is hanging, and the rook can be taken by two pieces, if you play rook d1 check, then queen takes rook, threatening to play pawn takes queen, so you can't take the rook, because the queen is worth more than the rook, and if you try to save the queen, for example, queen goes to c6 square, then queen h5, threatening mate in 1, then rook check, king to b3. Bishop check, you can't take the bishop, because of queen check on c5 square, so king a2, king runs, rook takes, alpha is threatening to play queen takes f7, so queen here, then bishop to f6, threatening to play queen h8 mate, checkmate is unstoppable, so, back to the position, king can't take the rook, because the queen is hanging, so queen takes knight, sacrificing a queen, bishop takes queen, rook takes, queen goes to h5, threatening mate in 1, rook takes b3, you should not take it, because of bishop check on e4, then you will lose your rook, so, king a2, rook check, king slides, rook takes check, you can't take it, because of the same reason, so king backs, rook check, now he takes the rook, because he gets the another rook, bishop takes rook, queen back to f3, two bishops for a queen, bishop here, pawn move, king to a4, the king runs into the black's territory, king takes, the bishops can't do anything, the king reached in the 8th rank of the board, look at this great king walk. The king walk all the way to reach his destination to attack black's pawn's structure, because queen and this pawn can't damage to white, so bishop check, king here, pawn move, queen to b7, targeting on the pawn, bishop protects, pawn comes to remove the guard, takes, another guy come to pressure on the pawn, g6, pawn can't take it, because it's pinned, king runs, takes, here, takes, the h pawn goes to h8 square to become a new queen. Pawn promotes, check check, checkmate. Let's go to our final game, e4 by me, g6, king's indian setup, knight c3, d6, bishop here, knight to f5, a4, and you know, these games are 1 minute clock time games, 
which means both side have one minute time to play the whole game, I can play knight here, or h5, h6, bishop here, e6 by him, very passive move, best was to play bishop here, we have e5, I am threatening to play knight takes pawn, if pawn takes, then bishop takes check, move the pawn to support the bishop, knight here. To get another piece activity on g6 square, rook here then rook f4, rook f7 check with the bishop, knight goes to e7, queen up to d2, queen here, long castle, he can do castle, castle in different sides, this structure is not same as the previous one, we have knight to d7, pawn takes, queen takes, bishop here, bishop there, takes takes, knight here, rook backs, knight here, I can play knight here, then b3, he played queen here, threatening to play queen a2, then knight takes knight, pawn takes. Using the open file by playing rook d8, queen check will be a threat, so after queen here, trying to escape the king, position will be bad for white. So, king to b1, queen takes, queen slides, threatening to play knight takes knight, king takes, then knight check, push the pawn, if he take it, then bishop here, rook to h2, the king and queen position will be very bad, every squares of the queen will be blocked by somebody, it will be minus 4 position, so knight takes knight, pawn takes knight, queen here, h5, knight here, rook to g1, I can play rook to g4, he takes the bishop with knight, pawn takes g6, you can't save your knight because of the queen, pawn takes, rook here. He finally castle short, rook takes, queen here, rook to g8, c5, rook e5, blocking the pawn line and threatening this, rook d8, rook here, queen here, takes, check, here, check, takes, and after some moves later, we have this position, check, here, check, queen check, and the game turns into a draw by three moves repetition, because if you try play king here or there, then queen takes, king here, check, and it will be checkmate. But alpha zero didn't play that move, he makes the game draw. Alpha zero wins the tournament, wish you all the best, thanks for watching subscribe for more, bye bye take care, see you soon.